Hey y'all, I just wanted to let you know even though I am goofing around making some goofy videos, I am still prepping. I've got uh, 16 pints of beans in there, wax beans. Thought my bean cannon days were over this year. Stopped at a buddy's house and he had a bumper crop and I picked a bushel basket full of wax beans. I still got more to clean and get ready, but when you're looking at the clock, worrying about what time it is, because you got to go to work, it it really puts a crimp in your style. But I've got the beans in there, and right over here I got the old dehydrator going again. And my first time I did my tomatoes, you know, I had the black ones that turned black. This time. I use a stainless steel knife and I only use tomatoes that were just right or just about right and they all look great. So I, my, I think what it was was I had some tomatoes that were over ripe the last time and that's what caused them to turn black. At least that's what I'm going to go with. But I did use a stainless steel knife to cut them also so it looks good. I have a total of I think 14 trays for this. It says it's expandable to 12. I, I had two. I did two batches of onions that I had 13 trays on there, and it took a long time to get them dry. But I figure if I'm going to run it, I'm going to run it full. So uh, I've got those down there sealed in uh, half gallon canning jars using my Tatler reusable lids and they work great. Uh, when I get done I'm going to do some more grinding up of tomatoes, peppers and, and the onions and make powder out of it. I think uh, I got an idea what I want to do and I'll show you. Here's my winter cro uh, squash crop. Um, I'm going to have to look up the bugs. There's a, a bug that eats the vines and kills the vines, and then they were all over my squash. I figured I'd better get them before uh, they just went bad. So I brought them up here by the shop. I'm going to have to try to clean them, cut them up, and can them. Uh, there are pretty nice ones in here. These are Kashaw, I think is how you pronounce it. I like these. Uh, we several years ago I grew them and I canned them and then my wife made uh, pumpkin pies out of them and man I really liked them. Unfortunately my wife and daughter didn't care for them as much as pumpkin but hopefully I can get some pies made out of them this year. I might have to learn how to make pie. That's kind of a scary thought. Thanks for watching.